Welcome to JSA TV and JSA Podcast. We are coming to you live from DCD Connect, Virginia. We just grabbed Sean off the expo floor, and he is president at Redivider. Sean, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks for having me. Of course. So I got a little bit ahead of it by saying your title there, but you have a new role. Congratulations are in order. Yeah. You want to tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, I'm excited. Um, it's, a, it's an honor to be the, the president of the Redivider. Um, it's a company that's focused on innovation and disruption in today's technology of data centers. Um, it's an exciting position. Uh, we, we have a lot of demand in this space. Um, prefab modular units are something I think the industry as a whole is looking forward to. Uh, it's, it's not your traditional brick and mortar data centers, but it actually is meeting the demands of what clients need today um, and easily replaceable for future designs of the IT architecture heading forward. Well, meeting those demands, that's what everyone wants, right? And I got just to- Just in time. <laughs> <laughs> just in time. And I got to talk to the team a little bit last night. Everyone is thrilled to have you. So congratulations again. Awesome, awesome, thank you. And with, you know, we're talking trends. We're already talking 2024. Where do you see the market going and how does Redivider play into that? Yeah, so there, there's this, um, this is, word that's out a lot, it's probably overused now, but it's called AI. <laughs> I've heard it a couple times this week. <laughs> Just especially here, right? Yeah. Um, yeah, so what what the demand of AI is outpacing what happened with hyperscale when it was growing. And the, the problem is we, we, we're out of power, we're out of space. Um, the demand um, for data centers is out of this world, but the supply isn't able to keep up with the demand. Uh, so what we're doing is offering up a solution to meet the demand with multi-tier solutions. So it doesn't have to be a tier three concurrently maintainable data center. Um, it can be multi-design, multi-use. Um, IT architecture continues to change. So air cool solutions are what most data centers have today. Uh, what happens when the IT architecture changes to liquid cooling? Well, I can replace that module with high density air cool solutions, 90 kW a cabinet, per cabinet. This is unheard of in our industry, right. right? I can replace that with a liquid cool solution for cold plate technology when that's readily available. I can do immersion cooling when that needs to be happening. So having the option and flexibility is where modular is really going to play a key part in today's industry. Absolutely. Like everything you just said, flexibility is key there. And for our viewers that want to learn more about Redivider, connect with you and get to talk a little bit more about your new role, where can they go to learn more, to reach out to you? Yeah. So find us at redivider.co. R-E-D-I-V-I-D-E-R.co. Um, and please feel free to reach out. Uh, my email is sean at redivider.co. Um, I look forward to working with everyone out there. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us and congratulations again. And thank you viewers for tuning in to JSA TV. Happy networking. Bye.